everyone, welcome to my channel, 10 Ways to Wear It. I'm Alicia, and on this channel, I take one fashion item or one fashion trend and show you guys 10 different ways to wear it. Now, in today's video, I'm going to be styling up a fashion item. It's one that's perfect to wear right now while we're experiencing winter weather, but it's also great for that spring transition that is quickly approaching, and that is a cozy knit sweater. Yes, you guys, in particular, I'm going to be styling up this off-white cozy oversized gorgeous sweater from ASOS. I recently purchased this. It was about 50 bucks and it runs super oversized you guys. I will link it below but keep that in mind. I ended up ordering a size 10 after ordering a 14 and a 12 because it is so big and even the 10 is super oversized you'll see in the outfits but I really love this sweater. It's a classic piece. It's gorgeous. It goes with so many things and you're gonna see how versatile a cozy knit sweater is in this video. I debated on whether to do like multiple color sweaters sweaters but I decided you know what let's just do a really nice clean classic so that's what we're doing today if you want to see 15 different ways to style up an off-white cozy knit sweater and you can replace it with any sweater that you have stay tuned for this video y'all gonna like this one okay if you're a really classic dresser clean dresser modest dresser girl I got something for you today <laughs> check this out So for this first outfit, I decided to go with a really clean, monochromatic, cool street style vibe. These vinyl joggers are from ASOS. They are so cool. They're sort of like an off-white color and they match the oversized sweater perfectly. This is such a gorgeous outfit, definitely giving me a really clean street style vibe. I also threw on these zebra printed booties. Those are also from ASOS and sort of some white acrylic earrings just to finish off the look with a really monochrome accessory. I love this look look I think it's so clean and fashionable but it's also very upscale really shows the versatility off the bat of this oversized sweater it's so cute tucked slightly into those vinyl joggers gorgeous look This next outfit is definitely giving me cool, chill weekend vibes. I threw on this Brixton hat, which is from Amazon. I really love this hat. It's so cool. It has like the suede string in it. With my wide leg, high-waisted Levi's, those I purchased from TJ Maxx a few months ago. Of course, they look so good with the oversized sweater slightly tucked into them. I also threw on my leopard print Sam Edelman boots. Gorgeous finish to this absolutely cool and chic outfit. Really easy to recreate. All you need is an off-white oversized sweater, some wide leg jeans, whether they're cropped or full length, and some leopard print boots, and bam, girl, you are looking so cool, just like me in this outfit. For this next look, I sort of went with a nautical color scheme. I threw on the oversized sweater with these high-waisted sailor pants. Those I thrifted a few months ago. You guys saw those in one of my thrift videos. And I threw them on with these crocodile embossed platform mules. These are so gorgeous. Those are made by the brand Topshop. Recently purchased from Nordstrom. You guys saw those in my low heel haul. They are so comfortable and cool and they look so good with these sailor pants and that sweater, honey. I am feeling this outfit. I think it looks so good. You can always throw on a necklace with this. You can throw on a jacket over it, of course, but I really love this look. It's super clean. Again, giving me kind of a nautical vibe with that red, white, and blue. Just a gorgeous clean cut outfit that looks very grown up and semi sexy. I love this. To the rebel lines from the tattered bridges to expensive dishes. Now we eat ends with these new beginnings. Yet the sign of nature for the bank, bro. But thank the Lord that I 
thousand penitentiary nights. Sky, but my inside is in a mighty flashy with a bird's eye. Scribble gems to get my pockets lined till I get arthritis. My heart is icy, walking past the bouncer like I knew somebody cool like Kelly Cloudy or the poison ivy. But from like a stroller with a coat sign, me, I don't even like me. No, I'm staring in the mirror in different poses. He claimed me the realest to shy, but timid. The riddles were fingers, they simple minded. Find a road on top, I'm taking it. From the ground, I'll be paving it. Hella bows for when I'm ventilating. Too much on my face, then they take it. Now, you guys have been seeing these thrifted cutoff Levi's in my videos a lot lately. I really love them, you guys. I ended up cutting these jeans because I didn't like the way they looked at the ankle. They were just a little weird, but they look so good as cutoffs. And Bermuda shorts are a big thing in 2020. So I think this look is so cool. The oversized sweater tucks slightly into those cutoff Levi's. And of course, on the feet, I have on my Snake Embossed Steve Madden boots. They look so good, especially with this belt from boohoo that has like a snake print on it as well this outfit looks so cool you can throw on a trench coat with this you can throw on a bomber jacket you can throw on an aviator to finish this off but i really love this look and it's barely any leg showing so you can definitely wear a look like this right now my advice if you have some jeans that have like an awkward length or they just don't look good at the bottom honey cut them off right above the knee and you have a really cute pair of cut off bermuda shorts to wear this year yeah, I've been as quick to set him straight. Yeah, I'm really next to that name. California on the birth certificate. How we claim it, they ain't seen the wave. How we painted on the level up. The tattered garments, been a starving artist. It's like 09, that was gold time. But clothes, man, that's where my heart is hot. You need a place, man. For my family's sake, I've been through some things. Make a better way. Why do I put out a place here? Why ain't you my face? Nobody better with the rhetoric. Keep out your core with the predicates. West side, west side. You dead right, dead right. But I'm hating lanes from my side. Quick to switch, I tell him to behave. From the attic to the airwaves. Now this knit skirt from ASOS is one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe. It's such an easy piece to style up. I wear it all the time with white t-shirts, denim jackets, all types of pieces. It's such an easy piece to style and it's so comfortable. And I thought it would look so good with this oversized sweater slightly tucked in the front. I really love this look. This is a look that you can wear on a date night, girls night chill weekend whatever you're doing this look will have you set and ready to go i threw on the skirt with these taupe adidas falcons those are also from asos and i've had those for about a year now and i just thought this outfit looks so cool and chill but also really cute that fitted skirt looks so nice those pearl hoops finish it off perfectly this is a look that's easy to recreate you can find those knit skirts pretty much anywhere you can google them or you can find them on fashion nova asos pretty little thing misguided boohoo any of those websites just go on the search engine and type in knit skirt and honey you will find one just like this <laughs> In this next look, I'm featuring another one of my wonderful thrifted items, this mango denim skirt I recently picked up. You guys saw that in my Thrift With Me episode number three. I really love this skirt with the oversized sweater. Again, showing the versatility of a really nice classic oversized sweater. This outfit looks so nice. I threw on this tan beret that is from Misguided, purchased on the ASOS website, and of course finished it off with my suede Sam Edelman boots. This outfit is so cool. It has all the vibes, honey street style sexiness coolness i really love this look very simple to put together you don't have to use a beret but why not cherry on top of the sunday i really love this look
my goodness, these sage green faux leather pants are definitely another favorite in my wardrobe. You guys saw those in a haul that I recently did. I really love the fit of these pants. They're so clean and classic, and that color is just gorgeous. It looks so nice with the off-white oversized sweater slightly tucked into it. I threw on these double-strapped clear heels. Those are from Amazon. Threw on a couple of bangles. Those are my thrifted bangles that I purchased a while back. And yeah, you guys, this outfit is so hitting. I really love this look. And you can easily pull this off whether you're doing joggers, whether you're doing, you know, any type of full leather pants. You can pull off this look and as you can see I am loving it girl <laughs> such a cute and sexy outfit to wear just about anywhere I love it Now, like I said earlier, Bermuda shorts are clearly a thing in 2020. They were all over the runways last year, at the end of last year, so they are making a comeback from the 90s once again. And these are from Target. I've had those for about a year and a half. You guys saw those in a Target haul that I did way back. They even come with a matching jacket, but they're like a linen striped pair of Bermuda shorts. I love the length of them. I love that tie waist, and I thought they looked so good with the oversized sweater tucked into them. Showing again the versatility of these sweaters, really showing that even though they are oversized and kind of long, you can tuck them into looser pieces. I also threw them on with these sort of gladiator heels. Those are from Boohoo. I've had those for a few years now, and I just think this is such a great outfit. Throw on a wide brim hat, you know, a Zorro style hat, honey. Finish off that outfit, so sharp. I really love this. I will definitely be wearing this. Hey, look at me using all my thrifted pieces. <laughs> I love this outfit as well, you guys. I threw on those plaid sort of jogger style pants. Those are thrifted from Crossroads Trading. You guys saw those in my recent thrift video, but I thought they would look so good again with that sweater. The off-white goes good with just about anything. I mean, you can pair any bottom with this sweater, but these are just some ideas for you. If you have some plaid joggers or some sort of crop plaid pants, you can definitely recreate this outfit. Throw on the off-white sweater, throw on some off-white booties like I did. I threw in this pearl and headband because it's sort of like a brown tannish color may not come across on camera but I thought it would look so good to finish off this outfit and just add sort of a feminine touch to it I really love this as well so cute so simple and look at me being sustainable hey <laughs> Now a classic black and white look is something you can never go wrong with. For this outfit, I threw on these high-waisted black faux leather joggers those are from ASOS they're sort of like a cargo jogger with the oversized sweater they look so so good my nine west peep toe booties are always just the thing to finish off any outfit and add a little bit of sexiness to it but I love this look it's very clean very simple like I said black and white is a classic so you can't go wrong throwing on a pair of faux leather pants in black or faux leather joggers like I did this look is so classic and nice definitely giving me street style vibes I will wear this any day of the week because it is such a cool and sexy outfit.
Now this is a perfect look for my working ladies out there. These high-waisted cropped plaid pants are from H&M. I've had those for a few years now, but you can still find this style of pants at H&M and several other websites. But I thought they would look so good with the off-white oversized sweater. The purpose of this video is also to show you guys how to tuck these oversized sweaters. And this is a great example showing you how they can be tucked into pants and still look very sleek and not bulky. I really love this look. Of course, the cherry on top is that faux leather beret that I'm wearing that is from Forever 21. I've also had that for over a year and my black stiletto booties really just keep this outfit super cool and clean. Again, this is something great to wear to work. Really gorgeous, simple, clean cut outfit that's also a little cozy. <laughs> Now, of course, after a work outfit, I wanna give you guys something a little fun, and these Levi 501 jeans with this sort of Western style embroidery on them are so cool. Definitely a great weekend pair of jeans. They look so good with the oversized sweater. I threw on this white Western belt, and of course, on my feet, I'm wearing these silver cowboy style booties. They have like stars and lightning on them, so they look so good pulling out that sort of Western vibe on those jeans. These jeans are actually recently purchased from T tjmax.com and I really love them y'all know how I love Levi 501s I have like 10 pair and I'm obsessed with them so I was really happy to find this sort of like embroidered pair I thought these were really cool with that western pattern on them and they look so good with the sweater easy outfit to recreate you can throw it on with regular jeans or you can seek out these I will link them below but yeah I love this look as well Now here is another jean look that I am absolutely obsessed with. This one is a little bit more feminine than the last one because you have these sort of cuffed jeans. These are like bubble style jeans. They're actually really, really wide right at the thigh and the knee so they kind of flare out. They're just a really cool style pair of jeans. I actually purchased these from AliExpress. I've been intending to do an AliExpress haul for you guys but I'm kind of nervous about doing it because of everything going on in China with the coronavirus and all. I've ordered this stuff like months ago so I may actually still go ahead and do the video but I love these jeans they are so so cute they came with this belt they also came with the belts at the ankles and they're just a really cool pair of jeans but you can also find these bubble jeans other places I will link another pair that I have from Fashion Nova below I do have other styles of these jeans and I think they're so cool a really great trend for 2020 and it looks so good with these rose gold heels and of course that oversized sweater really cute outfit Everybody's been saying that you're up to no good Everyone has been telling me that you got me hood You're playing it big time you're feeding me lies. Everyone has been bugging me. So to give you guys another work-friendly outfit, I decided to pair the oversized sweater with this pleated satin pink skirt. That is from Misguided, purchased on the ASOS website. I also threw on these metallic pink loafers. Those are from Target. Both of those items were purchased mid to early last year so I'm not even sure if I'll be able to link those but I thought it looked so good with the oversized sweater just showing you that these sweaters can be tucked in yes you can kind of see them because they are chunky they are oversized they do have a little extra meat and folds on them but you can tuck them into skirts you can tuck them into jeans you can tuck them into pants and they still look nice it doesn't matter if a few little wrinkles are showing don't let that discourage you this outfit looks so good definitely something I would wear to an office environment or 
or if I'm going to something where I just want to look really cute but clean, church, something like that, this would be a great outfit to wear. So this next outfit is another really cute and modest pairing. I threw on the oversized sweater on top of this black satin slip dress that is from ASOS. I think this is such a nice put together. Again, this is something you can wear to work, to church. I also threw on these cowhide spotted loafers. Those are from ASOS and I think this is such a really upscale, nice, clean look for my grown ladies out there who like to keep covered up. You can always throw on a nice long cardigan with this or a duster, something like that, and we'll finish it off perfectly but I really love this look that sort of stretchy grass belt is from Amazon and I threw it on with these rattan earrings just to kind of bring it all together I think this is such a nice look I would totally wear this for church or something like that throw on a jacket with it throw on a nice chunky sweater like a long sweater and it would look so so good I really love this look super easy to recreate just throw the sweater over a slip dress belt it and bam you're good to go so much for watching this video on how to style up a cozy knit sweater I really hope you enjoyed it I hope you like all the looks that I came up with as you can see this is the perfect spring transition item it's great to wear right now of course because you can layer on top of it and under it but it's also great for when we start warming up when the flowers start blooming when the trees start putting their weeds back in you know all that this is a great item to have you cannot go wrong with having a nice cozy knit in your wardrobe they last long they're versatile they're classic they're clean they're modest they're just grown folks stuff okay <laughs> but I hope y'all enjoyed this video definitely hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed come back and visit me again I got a lot of great content on my channel so much more to come this year we are about to blow up on this channel y'all I'm telling you I am working hard to bring you the best that I can and to bring you something new so if you're interested in a new type of YouTube experience hit that subscribe button come back and visit me and I will see all of you guys on the next video. Love y'all. Bye guys. <laughs>